I'm uh, Dr Mark Gillett, I'm an Associate Professor at the Department of the Built Environment at the University of Nottingham. My research and teaching relates to energy use in the built environment. Um, most of the work that I do in terms of teaching is looking at renewable energy systems and energy efficient systems for future building designers to educate them on how to make their buildings more energy efficient. Buildings account for a huge amount of energy use um, globally. Um, they're responsible for a significant proportion of associated CO2 emissions. We all use buildings every day of our lives and it's very important that we understand how that energy is used, not only how it's produced at, uh, at the front end but also how it's used within the built environment and our research is all about trying to minimize the demand and use of that energy so demand reduction but also supplying it in a more efficient way so developing new systems and developing cheaper systems as well so that their wide-scale use can be applicable globally. It might be a heating system so it might be a traditional boiler but the heat exchanger within the boiler there might be some fundamental change you can make to that to make it more efficient. It might be something like a, a heat pump system where we've investigated different working fluids to increase the performance, the coefficient of performance, the efficiency of the system. We, we use energy for lighting, heating, um, all our appliances and you know, not only is it a technological thing, it's also about um, how people behave within the buildings themselves, how we can alter behaviour patterns without impacting on people's everyday lives as well. I think that's a, a key thing so that technology is accepted by the users. The, the unique thing about the University of Nottingham is we have a suite of experimental research houses. Um, right, through from, right through to Zero Carbon Homes, which is the government's 2016 aspiration in the UK and it gives us a unique opportunity to see how these systems actually work in reality because the homes are occupied and they're fully instrumented and monitored so we can understand how they work and interact with the occupants but also how they perform in reality and that's a key thing we we as designers and researchers can develop systems but if they're not used by the occupants and, and people properly then you know all our efforts are wasted so it's important to, to qualify our designs with post-occupancy evaluation. Mm -hmm.